Hello everyone, uh, welcome in my channel WPF. So uh, today I'm going to show you how to show color dialog box in WPF. You know very well about uh, the color dialog box. Uh, if you are using uh, Windows form, then you have a color dialog box control in the toolbox, but in the WPF you have not. So uh, how to use a Windows form color dialog box in WPF? It's easy to use it. So first of all, uh, add a one button control and a text box control. When we click on the button control, a dialog, uh, you, I can say that uh, color dialog so is open and the color dialog is actually exist in system.windows.forms namespace and that is already exist in your reference. If you not, then must to add it. Right click on your reference, add reference and search on it system.windows.forms. Uh, it's pretty simple to search system.windows.forms form and that is and resolve this usings by using control dot press the control dot on your uh, class name and resolve this issues okay so when your color dialog box is open then you select any colors from your palettes and press ok button so dlg dot show dialog and the system dot uh, do not use the dialog result because the dialog result is actually um, used in WPF but you can see that there is not available dot ok method so use it system dot windows dot forms dot dialog result this is the method or you can say dot dialog result is an enumeration is available in system.windows.forms namespace okay after pressing your ok button uh, you want to change your uh, color of your uh, text which is exist in the text box so first to give uh, the name to the text box is text box 1 tx1 tb1 dot uh, foreground dot equals to sorry new solid brush solid color brush and in which you can add argb file uh, color dot mm, from argb and in which you can add these are the bytes a bytes r byte g and byte p okay argb okay so I want to select from um, dialog box so dlg dot color dot a dlg dot color okay You, you notice that uh, the color dot from ARGB is show the R value so use the R okay uh, that is the intelligence is given under your um, cursor it's follow you Z and the last one is B so use it DLZ dot color dot B so thank you very much for watching this video please keep watching my all other videos which is related to WPF and also you can see uh, UWP video tutorials so thank you very much again and in the next video tutorial I'm going to show you the font dialog box uh, in WPF and that is colored is ex actually exist in Windows space that is use anything in use uh, use the control dot key so there is your example here so thank you very much for watching this video and uh, please don't forget Please, 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 I request you, uh, please subscribe my channel. Thank you very much for watching this video.